Yo everybody, my name is Chris Puncelan. Welcome back to another video. Uh, so the homie, Ed Talenti, sent me, Sicky Beats, and Simon Servita the same sample to see how we could all flip it. So in today's video, I'm gonna break down how I made my beat and show you how the others reacted to it. And I'm also gonna show you the reactions to the other beats. Uh, but first, let me show you the original sample. <laughs> And then before we get into the breakdown, let me show you how everybody reacted to my beat. Ooh, I like that tempo there. Good sample, where's this from? That cool chorusy effect, I like that. Oh, this is smooth. That's the groove, oh my gosh. Those drums are hard. And I love how he chopped that. Oh. The strings. That's sick. Ew. Ooh. Oh, that piano. Those little vocals in the back, that's crazy. I'm feeling this one. I love those strings. Switch up, nice. We're going like straight up lo fi with the vocal sample and everything. Hey. Oh. oh, boy, it's like some lounge music. God damn, dude, this is dope. Oh, that's crazy. That piano is beautiful, and the vocal. That switch up was seamless. I love the little bells that you have in there. That was crazy, Chris. That was crazy. This is going to be crazy, man. This is sick. Gosh, that first half was like vintage Chris Punslot. Like with the melody and the box and just the way the drum, just the whole groove. But I didn't see that second part coming. That switch up was crazy. I was going for a boom bat feel, so I built these drums. Chopped up the sample and sprinkled them on the drums. Added a bass line. Added some strings for the turnaround. Then after eight bars, I added a piano. course, I had to add some vocals. Moving on to the second part of the track. So I took a few parts of the sample and looped it. Then I added a plugin called Movement, EQ'd it, added a plugin called Kickstart, added some auto pan, and some delay. Then I made the drums. Added an 808, some keys.
some strings. A bell melody, and of course, had to add some vocals. So I put the two tracks together by exporting the first track, threw that beat into the second beat project, automated the BPM in the master channel uh, to switch from 90 to 60, which is the BPM of the second track, added a sweep at the end of the first track to smoothly transition into the next one, and that's how I blended the two songs. Ooh. I love how you chopped it up, bro. Fuck, this is already better than mine. That's a it's completely new melody. Boy. Ew. <laughs> That's such a good bounce. These flutes are hard. And the drums just hit hard, they're nasty. Tape style. And the 808 slides too? <laughs> it's so swaggy. Dude, this is gonna be insane. All these are crazy. If you heard the original sample, it's really fluttery and there's a lot of movement. And he was able to really just isolate a single pitch in that sample and make it really defined. Oh man, all of these beats are gonna be way better than mine. All right, Simon Servita. Oh shit, I'm going underwater. Oh! Hey! Did not expect that. Oh, I love the filter sweeps. The trap fill! Oh, what? Fuck! Oh, the 808 slides. Dude, that melody is insane. Simon's got the craziest 808 slides. Oh shit. Oh my god. Hey. This is wild. Dude, this is stupid hard. The auto panned 808s are the left and right 808s. That was wild. The 808 slides at the end there were nuts. That was crazy. Dude, that 808 feel like that was crazy. Dude, the the panned 808. What? Oh, good sample. Where'd you get that one from? Automated reverb. Mm -hmm. Such a cool airy vibe. I love it. That's crazy. All of our sound different. Oh shit. Hey. That drum fill? Oh my gosh. Dude, this is crazy. I love the percussions on this. So good. I didn't know it was gonna drop like this. Woohoo! Dude, all those little vocal samples that like, really had like a cool texture. That's awesome. Wow, dude. These are all better than mine. 
I'm really self-conscious about mine right now. <laughs> Dude, these guys are insanely talented. Good job, guys. Good job, everyone. That was crazy. If you want to check out how the other producers made their beat, all of their links are in the description. Shout out to Ed for uh, bringing us all together and seeing how we could chop up the sample. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up because it does help out the channel a ton. Um, if you want to stream the entire track that I made in today's video, it's linked in the description. Um, and yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for a future video, please let me know in the comments below and I'll try my best to respond. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.